friends and welcome to Vyapar Learning Hub. As you all know that according to the government rules, it is mandatory for all B2B businesses with a turnover of more than 20 crores to generate any invoice. And recently the government has reduced this limit to 10 crores, that means if the annual turnover of your business is more than 10 crores, then it will be mandatory for you to create an invoice from 1st October 2022. And if you have not generated the invoice, then you have to pay penalty against it also. Either 100% of tax which is due on that invoice, or 10,000 whichever is higher. But what is this e-invoice after all? The invoice is the system brought by the government in which the invoice has to be uploaded and authenticated electronically on the government portal. And for that from the government portal you get a unique invoice reference number that is IRN number and along with a QR code is also generated which will have all the details of your invoice. So the question is how will you generate the invoice? So in the Vyapar app you also get this option. That is, from a single app you can generate invoice, e-invoice as well as e-way bill. Let's see how. So for this, first of all, we will open the Vyapar billing software. Now whenever you will do any B2B transaction, that is go to create invoice of a party whose GST details are already added and sales invoice that is transaction is also taxed in this way. Then below you will see the option of generate e-invoice button. So we will click on it. Now here you have to log in with your login details. If you do not have GSP login credentials, then you can visit this link below to see how you can create GSP details. But if you already have these details, then enter the details in this way and then you will log in. Then we will reach the screen of e-invoice, here all the details will be already filled based on your invoice details. Such as seller details, transaction details, buyer details, item details. Some of these details will be mandatory and some are optional. So once you will see if all the mandatory details are completely entered or not. If it is then you will get the sign of verified in this way on every section and if not, then you will get the sign of unverified in this way. So by going to it, you enter the details like here we had not added the HSM code of the item, then we will enter it and then click on generate e-invoice button. Note that in some situations you may get an error when you are saving the e-invoice. For example, if the invoice number for which you are currently generating any invoice already has any invoice associated to it. Or you have not filled the mandatory details or you have entered the wrong details. Or else you are doing sale in other state but you have imposed GST not IGST. So while creating the e-invoice, make sure that you have entered all the details correctly because if you create a wrong e-invoice and submit the same, then as per the government rules, you may have to pay a penalty of 25,000 rupees against that invoice. So you can see that our e-invoice has been generated and there is a unique invoice reference number, as we mentioned IRN along with the QR code below on the invoice. But if you have created a wrong invoice by mistake, then in that case you get a time limit of 24 hours, that is, you can cancel this invoice in the next 24 hours. Let's see how. So for this we will open the existing invoice in this way. Now the most important thing here is that you cannot edit the created invoice. It can only be cancelled. So for this here you will get two options below e-invoice. One is view invoice. That is by clicking here you can see the invoice in the standard format of the government which will look something like this and second cancel. By clicking here you can cancel this e-invoice and also now you can also generate e-way bill from here. How? 
For that, you can watch the full video by visiting the link given in the description below. So this was how to generate e-invoice in Vyapar. So what are you thinking? Quickly open the laptop and generate e-invoice in a pinch. That's all in this video. We will meet you with new updates in the next video till then. Like this video and share it as much as you can and do not forget to subscribe to this channel and pressing the bell icon, only then you will get our next video on time. Thank you so much for watching this video. Happy Vyaparing!